What's up, ladies and gents? This is your boy DJ Rican um, with a new video. This is basically uh, branching off the video I had before the previous video, which is on the Roll Clutch RK61 keyboard, which we have right here. Now, they actually had maybe a couple people actually said that they act, they have the same exact keyboard and it's not working for them. Uh, not exactly sure what it may be, but let me show you how it's working for me. Maybe that might help. All right, so for, first of all, on the very back of the keyboard, it's an on and off, on and off button. Well, you turn it on, it'll pretty much turn on in the Wi-Fi mode. Now, as far as the Bluetooth, I'm not sure exactly uh, how that's, you know, that's working, uh, but I, I definitely will show you the way that I use it. All right, so basically right now when you put on the on mode, it just turns on, it's supposed to be able to pick it up, Bluetooth, and you'd be able to operate it with whatever it is that you use it on. Uh, today we're gonna turn that off, all right? So basically how I work mine is this, I have my USB where I would charge the remote just like as you guys can see here. All right, this is my remote controller USB. This is where we charge it, connect it, so forth. So that same exact uh, USB cord, which is a type C, I believe, would just literally, simply just go onto the keyboard, on the keyboard just right there. Now remember, the off, it's, it needs to be on the off switch. I have it on the off switch. All right, so literally plug it in and it turns on, on its own, okay? So we're just going to put this down here and uh, we're going to use the remote for right now just to get into my profile as we go on here. I'm not Definitely not the best picture, but at least you'll still be able to tell that it does work. All right, guys. So let me just turn off this notification here. Now we're in the main screen on the PlayStation. My remote's on. I already got my, blow, uh, my, my mouse uh, plugged in uh, via USB as well. And we're using one of my v uh, USB ports on my PlayStation 4 Pro. Got the keyboard uh, locked in. Now, see, as I moved the mouse and clicked, it came up. And if you if you saw that, it has the mouse and keyboard icon. Here, look, right now I'm using the keyboard. So, at first, I will say in the very beginning, when I first plugged it in into my PlayStation 4 and I started it up, I did have to go into settings, just like you let's see if you can see here. And I did go into devices. I did go into here, Bluetooth devices. Now it was showing up here in my Bluetooth devices. You gotta give it some time. Now what I had to do was, after I give it, gave it time, I had to scroll all the way down. And the thing is, things keep popping up. So it's not necessarily right here at the top. It was kind of weird. I had to go all the way down on my remote controller and actually found the Royal, Clay, uh, Royal Clutch RK61 option. Now when I went to the Royal Clutch uh, K61 option in my Bluetooth devices, when it finally pulled up, I went ahead, clicked on it, and registered. So you have to register it for the first time. So you think it keeps popping up, so it's like it keeps picking up uh, the signal for the keyboard. So eventually it will pick it up. It should pick it up. It did for me. And, and, and even right here, I can back out. You can go into the menu. Uh, you can't use your mouse right here in the PlayStation screen, but you can use your keyboard to scroll around. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to a monster keyboard compatible game, which is uh, one of the very few right now, it's Fortnite, which is very popular. So we're gonna go into Fortnite. I'm gonna put my controller to the side because we're just gonna start using my, the monster keyboard from here on out. Again, if you didn't see the, as much as the uh, different features on the keyboard or, uh, in my earlier, my previous video, here again, you know, you can change the light up. Let's look at it to something fun here. Something neat, that way you can get some light up action here. That's, that was pretty neat, I like that. All right, so as we load up here again, I have it connected via USB with the same exact uh, USB cord that you use to charge your remote or plug in your remote controller for the PlayStation 4 or PlayStation 4 Pro. Again, I'm currently using the PlayStation 4 Pro at the moment. My mouse is a Corsair mouse. Jeez, uh, I can't even remember the model. Harpoon, I believe it is. I can't remember the model of my mouse. <laughs> anyway, so it's a Corsair. Um, I have a Corsair mouse pad. Um, 
the extra large uh, mouse pad. As you guys can see here, my little mini setup to start off with. And here we are, Fortnite. Click to start. Click to start. There we go. I changed my DPS, whoops. All right, so we're logging into Fortnite. We use the mouse, literally to click to start, just like you would on PC. Again, we're on PlayStation 4. You guys saw in the very beginning, this is what it is, PlayStation 4. You see, I'm operating with my mouse so far. Uh, let's go ahead and play. Don't play, I haven't played Fortnite since season, maybe a couple of games, just to basically do this video here. Let's just go ahead and see what we got. Let's just do an arena solo. We'll go in there. Look at that, zero points. All right, that's, that's a good start. Okay, so we're gonna go in here. Oh wait, let me go left. See right here, I'm going left and right. Uh, there you go, see? I'm using my mouse and keyboard, look at that. I'm using the keyboard. There we go. I just escaped out of the match, whoops. All right, let's try that again. So this, as you guys can see, now if I go back to my controller, it'll switch you back to controller mode when we go to Fortnite. It'll, it'll, but it still has me in the PC lobby because that's, I initially started with the mouse and keyboard, so it's not taking me out of that. You can't go from uh, keyboard and then to controller, I believe. No, yeah, you can. You can't go from controller to keyboard. Once you're in a uh, controller lobby, you can't switch back to keyboard. It won't mouse and keyboard. It won't let you do that on PlayStation. Uh, so still searching. We're trying to get a game going here. Uh, so it's a mouse and keyboard, supposedly lobby, but of course in arena you, with all other platforms, with you're in car, you cross platform. I'm sorry. All right, so here we go, guys. We're loading up Division One. That way you guys can see I'm actually using mouse and keyboard on PlayStation 4 or PlayStation 4 Pro. In my case, PlayStation 4 Pro. As we wait here to load up again, again, for those of you that still have an issue, just comment if you're still having an issue um, as far as getting your keyboard to work on there. Like, uh, maybe we can, we can work it out together, but this video is to show you guys that it does work. And this is the functionality for the slash, for slash gameplay video that I said I was going to come up with. So here we are, look at that. Boom, mouse and keyboard. We're using mouse and keyboard, ladies and gents, on PlayStation 4. We're going to get a quick job here. Uh, oh no, for, the key, for this game, the key binds, you can also customize it, even on PlayStation 4. You're allowed, to, you're able to do that. I don't know if you guys can tell um, that the video the quality is not the greatest, so I do apologize about that, but it is what it is, this is what we have here for the moment. My WASD, my WASD keys are customized. I bought these on Amazon Prime. You can, uh, I got them for like eight, nine dollars. So you can actually customize them. They have other, came with other keys as well, but I just swapped out the WASD keys um, for this particular uh, uh, moment here. But you can uh, search for different ones and do it to your own liking. All right, let's see here before I get smacked. I'm sure I'm, somebody's in here somewhere. I can't hear, press. I have no sound, guys. So if I do get shot up, please know that that's my excuse. in a long time. I can't hear anything, so that's, that's really crappy. But I am using mouse and keyboard, as you guys can see. I'll be surprised if I even get one guy. I should have put at least the, uh, anyway, we're just going to ride it out, boys and girls. This guy, this video is helping you guys. 
Let me see if I can just find somebody real quick. Just go for it. Just go at it. I don't know. I don't even know what this gun does. That's how long this missile that way. Oh, it's a scope. Oh, great. There you go, guys. Mouse awesome and keyboard. I'm sure there's somebody here at Lonely. What's that? That we can hear from get this over with. But here you guys have it. I'm using mouse and keyboard. It's an awesome keyboard. I mean, compared to a. Uh, what's that Tifu uses? A uh, Apple Ducky? Literally, for the price that you pay for an Apple Ducky, this is like literally like a tenth, or like a quarter of the price. Of, uh, of an Apple Ducky, and it does for me the same. I mean, it's a, it's an awesome keyboard. Not not to knock Apple Ducky, but if you're on a budget, this is definitely a good way to start. Uh, especially if you like, if you're into the new 60% keyboards, uh, which I personally favor. Uh, this would be a great, great way to go. A great way to start, just to save some money at the same time, and still get great quality. It's a great keyboard. I just wish they had way more compatible uh, mouse and keyboard games on the PlayStation. Look at that, I didn't know there was a chest there. Jump gun, no thanks. I'm really just, literally just trying to find somebody. I might just jump off this time. No, I'm just kidding. So we're going to just try to find somebody. There's got to be somebody here in London. Then again, nobody the really comes here, but okay. Somebody had that. If I get into a battle, if they're going to build battle, which like everybody's so sweaty at this game now. So if I get the, into a build battle, I'm so in trouble. Come on, it's got to be somebody. Y'all, give me a moment, man. I'm going to find somebody like very soon. That's crazy. I'm not, even, I'm not even really trying to get points. I'm just really trying to find somebody. Just so we can get out of here. I know y'all hear me in here. I know somebody hears me in here. I know there's somebody. Come on. Okay, I know where I can find somebody. Not literally, like I cannot go back to controller after playing mouse and keyboard uh, on Fortnite. This video is probably. I mean, you may feel free to fast forward at any given time. Right here in the middle of nowhere, just like that. It's a mechanic, very nice mechanical keyboard. Uh, Lovely, 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 lovely keyboard. Right, we're two, two people away from getting points here. Best believe, like, how about I run into somebody right now, not even get points. I'm having no issues. Like I'm literally having no issues. I'm not having any problems. It's working just fine. Come on, somebody's coming to me. I can sense it. Somebody's close. 
Uh, you can set up your sensitivity. Again, like I said before, you can uh, customize your keybinds to your liking. All that good stuff. Oh yeah, oh yeah, there's gotta be somebody around here. I know you got one person in here. Come on, I'm one person away from getting trash now compared to the fact that everybody's a slutty now in this game. Oh, man. I don't even know if you guys can see that well. Uh, I know the video quality is not so good. But, I mean, I'm sure you can see it just enough that I'm using the mouse and keyboard look spacebar jump. You know, my control is sitting right there to my left, and it's still working. What in the world is going on in, in retail? Beware of the horde. Oh, no way. There's zombies. That's so bad. Oh, that's so bad. There we go. And we have it, guys. I don't even know where he went. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. I got beat up, obviously, to this guy right here. But as you see, I was using the mouse and keyboard. I even got into a fight. It took forever. I'm sorry about that. We could probably edit the video eventually. But anyways, there you guys have it. We're going to leave the match. And we're literally going to go back to the PlayStation screen using the mouse and keyboard. We're not even using the controller anymore. We're going to go back to the main PlayStation 4 screen. Uh, we could actually hit escape. We can go down to... Oh, boy. Everything is different. How do you leave the map? Uh, okay. Select game mode. Settings. We're not going to log out. Let's just go to... Oh, my God. Excuse me. Let's just go to select game mode. There you guys have it. Mouse and keyboard gameplay. Alright. On the PlayStation 4 Pro. So that they go ahead and use the controller then. We're gonna go ahead and close the application. We're gonna go back out. I'm gonna put my controller right back down. And go back to the keyboard. There you guys go. So it does work. Again, if you have any issues, just be a little more detailed about what issues you're having and what you've done different that I've done where it's still not working for you, if that makes sense. Thank you guys for watching. Appreciate anyone that's been um, following as far as the last video. And again, thank you again, guys, for watching uh, this video. Peace.